You wouldn't think that dogs and ice cream would go hand in hand, but a recent ice cream social event proved otherwise. Southfield-based Fortune 500 federal mogul Tinoco recently held an ice cream social involving the Southfield Police Department and its canine unit, which was dedicated to federal mogul's legacy employees as part of a community engagement initiative designed to foster a spirit of goodwill between business and law enforcement. It's a wonderful event that we have had annually for the last three years for our employees, where we ask the city of Southfield to bring their canine unit out and we see the demonstrations and the things that they go through, how they train them, uh, how alert they are, the, the different tricks that they, they do for everybody. The afternoon featured a Q&A with the canine officers as well as an ice cream truck jam packed full of tasty treats. But it was the canine demonstrations that drew great interest. So what I, what I found in being a police officer for 20 years is the minute you bring out the canines, nobody wants to hear anything from the police officers anymore. The canines are always the hit of the show. It's always been true, whether you're dealing with adults or kids, they're the most popular thing. But the canines will come out, and usually what we do is we demonstrate some of their tracking abilities. We demonstrate uh, you know, the fact that, you know, the different scents that they can identify. Um, you know, we do some of the tricks, the jumping, and the, the, you know, some of the abilities they have. And then we we'll usually do some uh, you know, aggression work that, you know, that within the handlers demonstrating that. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna show you that it doesn't matter. Dennis is gonna fire a couple blank rounds, so be prepared for that. It's not gonna affect him at all. And as far as he's not gonna cower, he's not gonna, in fact, it'll probably amp him up a little bit. So uh, you can do it on the, on, the, on the run, Dennis, when he's coming in. Light, light, still. All right, let me see your hands. Let me see your hands. Drop that gun. Drop the 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 gun. the gun. Drop the gun. the gun. Drop the gun. Drop the gun. Drop the gun. Drop the uh, partner in the community. We work with our community in several different ways. We have created a recreational council made up of all the employees of Southfield and we do different things within the city. We do Habitat for Humanities, we uh, do uh, the American Cancer Walk, we're involved in so many different things. Even with the city itself we're partnering with Beats to, Eats to the Beats on uh, lunchtime when they have the different programs. We had a uh, uh, soccer team before, we've had a baseball team, so we really get involved in the city in which we uh, do business. So we consider ourselves not only a business partner, but a partner with the community as well. I, I think in today's day and age, the Southfield Police Department is first in the area in making sure that we not only provide excellent service um, to our residents, but that we engage our community in all different ways. And it's important for us to engage our residential community, but it's just as important that we support and engage our business community. And that's why we're here today, to make sure that our, our business community also gets to see us in a different light and gets to interact with us on, on something a little bit more fun for everyone with their ice cream social. To learn more about Federal Mogul Tentacle, visit federalmogul.com.